coming up is a form of combat that personifies the concept of every man for himself. We are in for a classic six-man battle royal. Making his way to the ring from Accra, Ghana, weighing in at 130 pounds, the Beast Boy. Guys, what better way to start the night off than with this one? I can't think of a better match to kick the night off, Michael. In fact, we haven't even gotten started yet, and I can assure you that this will be a tough match to follow. And her opponents, first, from the pits of hell, the Reaper, Demon. Here we go, and it sounds to me like the crowd is more than ready for this one. So am I, Michael. I've been looking forward to this match for a long, long time. And from Brooklyn, New York, weighing in at 404 pounds, the Cyborg. Corey, as we get ready to go, tell me, do you have a favorite heading into this battle royal? I've learned never to pick a favorite in a match like this. I mean, we once saw the Brooklyn Brawler win a battle royal, which tells me anything can truly happen here in WWE. And from out of this world, the Princess Superstar. If this one lives up to the hype, Byron, we're in for an amazing match here tonight. There's no reason to think this one won't live up to the hype, Michael. We're looking at some of the most intense competitors in all of WWE. And from New York, weighing in at 142 pounds, Robin. What a great match we have here to start off this night, guys. And Michael, I had to check twice when I saw this match listed as our opener. I mean, it could very well have been our main event. And from Milwaukee, Taryn. Guys, what better way to start the night off than with this one? I can't think of a better match to kick the night off, Michael. In fact, we haven't even gotten started yet, and I can assure you that this will be a tough match to follow. And there's bodies everywhere as we get this battle royal started. Guys, you can make a case for any one of these six competitors winning this battle royal. Whatever the outcome here tonight, this Brooklyn crowd is sure to be satisfied with this one. This is a level of destruction no one was expecting. Taryn may be in a bad way here. Well, moves like that at this stage are not to win any match. It's, they're just used to send a message. The clothesline finds the mark. That's one way of getting rid of it. Hey, it doesn't matter how you get out, just as long as you get out. Not going to win many matches with that move. And a savage clothesline. Well executed clothesline. The drop kick hits the target. A wild overhead punch wreaking havoc in here. The closed fist connects. And there's the face buster. Don't look in the mirror after that one. So damaging. Neck breaker, so devastating. Nope, reverses it. Comes up big with the reversal. Just toying with the competition a little. Clubbing clothesline. A big boot right there. Reverses that one. Walk back down hard. Wow, what a move. Dodges that one. Here's the gut wrench suplex. Never saw it coming. There was a little something extra behind that chop. How the 
heck does that not leave a competitor paralyzed? Brutal. I don't think there's any coming back from this type of assault. Oh no, a counter. Looking at it here. Vertical suplex. Nice. That should do it. There may be no coming back from that slam, Cole. There's a drop kick. Nice move. Oh, and it's a reversal. Take cover. You could call this a good old fashioned butt whooping. Takedown. A thunderous elbow shot. That one misses big time. Better luck next time. Got the reversal. Not today. You'd have to think hitting the finisher here could end this thing. I don't know, guys. I really thought we would have seen the finisher already. What an all-star ensemble in the ring right now. Six of WWE's most successful competitors for sure. That'll rearrange your spine. The end may be near. I think we're at the point in this match where the finisher could be used at any moment here. Just a matter of time now before this superstar goes for the finisher. And when that happens, you can bet this one's over. And it's reversed. Look out, look at incredible. This has to be it. That has got to be it. I don't know, guys. I really thought we would have seen the finisher already. Dropped by a clothesline. With the final elimination, and that's all she wrote. Win. And you could tell it took every ounce of energy in that body to pick up that last elimination. Very nicely done. Plenty more action still to come here tonight, folks.